Oh my gosh, is this Korean? I don't know how I, I don't know how this is my job. <laughs> hey, it's Josephine for The Point Shop. We're moving on with this try not to cringe, try not to comment challenge. I'm doing this series on models doing ballet. I feel bad doing this challenge because like, it's not the model's fault, but it's like their face on there. So it's like, we're making fun of them, but it's not. It's like really just the industry people, you know? Okay, let's try, let's do this thing. Is this a car commercial? I'm the art of speed. That's gonna be the name of my book one day. I mean, like I can almost see it, almost, you know? But like, we don't always have to put point shoes on, guys. Like we don't have to do it. We don't have to bring her in. Performance is an attitude. I don't know. I just feel like sometimes it's like so unnecessary. Like we can just dance without point shoes. It's fine, you know? It's like we're good all the way up until there. Why is it so close up? I'm already nervous. The way that the drawstring is tied? Nope. The gap being on the heel? Is this a commercial? Okay, the person, whoever's in the background look like they're dancers. Like, I, I don't understand what's happening and why this is a thing. How is, how is ballet related to this? Why are we doing this? Where are we? I'm sorry, daycare? I, I'm so confused about everything and what ballet has to do with anything. I'm just so confused. Slow mo on this. Wait, is this a commercial for like hand soap? Shampoo? <laughs> oh my gosh. How in the world are there, uh, how is there so many of these? Like, didn't you learn after like one? Like, how is it possible that so many people were like, yeah, let's do more of that. <laughs> Why are so many of these Asian? I feel like I wore this costume when I was like 12. The fact that there are multiple people in this room and no one is saying anything, Oh my gosh. And this is a beautiful girl. Like, she's like so gorgeous. Okay, I'm down for that. Do that. Do that. Just pose. Yeah, I'm down for this too. Flat shoes. Down for all of this. On board. Sure. Sure. Cool. No one's getting hurt. No one's in point shoes anymore. You know? I'm down for that. <laughs> you guys, I'm crying. <laughs> I have so many questions right now. Why, why are there point shoes going into the water? Okay, everyone who is involved in this, clearly they don't know what point shoes are made of. Why is this a thing? I don't know if I wanna keep watching this. Are they gonna go on point on the surfboard? Keeps getting worse. Showing the poetry of motion through the femininity of dancing on the waves by murdering point shoes. Okay, at least it didn't go there. I thought it was gonna progress where like she was gonna be on point on a surfboard. They just killed point shoes for it. So, you know, point shoes were harmed. I mean, I'm very much on the don't hate the player, hate the game. And like, I'm definitely hating on the game here. No hate to any models that are doing any of this because I know it wasn't your idea. You're just doing your job. I'm so sorry. <laughs> this is all beautiful. I'm 
for all of this. Like, and then it's like, why do we have to bring in point shoes? No need. But at least like she didn't go up on point, it's fine. Also, it's like, if you want to use point shoes as decoration, cool, just don't go up on point. Tener hemorroides se sufriría en silencio. No puedes pensar en otra cosa. Realmente duele, molesta, pica. Someone explain, if you speak Spanish, please translate this because my Spanish is very rough right now. Pero lo peor llega cuando tenés que ir al baño. Pero descubrí algo que me cambió la vida para siempre. Contractil. Mira, de acá, sin ningún almohadón, haciendo lo que me gusta. No puedo pedir más nada. There was not a single dancer over their box. Con efecto fluoconstrictor alivian la picazón, el dolor y la inflamación desde la primera toma. Contractil cápsula. What is this for? What is the, what? I have no idea what this commercial was for, but that last graphic was was kind of scary looking, but not as scary as the point shoes. Oh my gosh, is this Korean? I don't know how I, I don't know how this is my job. <laughs> the gapping on the sides, I mean, the most offensive thing about this is that the shoes are just so not her size. Not on board. I mean, look at this gorgeous girl. At least get her some shoes that fit her, please. Again, nothing to do with her. I don't know. This this series is rough, man. Rough. The ballet dancer. How? La ballerina per me è il simbolo della leggerezza, è un corpo dinamico, un movimento leggero. In questo caso l'ho vista I mean, they certainly look like dancers. Più mino, caldo, protettivo, che però non la blocca, non la frena. Ho cercato di creare un un capo che fosse protettivo, fosse confortevole ma anche dinamico, leggero. Okay, comparatively to everything else, not bad. I don't know what that is at the end though. Wow, that we could have done without that last shot. That was a dead giveaway. Is this a ponche? A lot of it's okay. Like, I think it's fantastic when the world takes inspiration from ballet. I think it's awesome, it's flattering, I love that it's going mainstream, all of that. I'm here for it. But it's not a natural position for people to be in, you know? Like, it takes very specific steps. Don't make people do it if they haven't been trained to do that. What is this? Belly. You know, not bad. Honestly, that wasn't the most horrifying thing I've ever seen. So, I mean, maybe it's because I've watched so many others that are like, <laughs> but um, not bad. Not bad, not good. I genuinely don't know if I can do another series like this. But if you guys want us to react to more, please tag us on more videos. If you don't follow Models Doing Ballet on Instagram, do yourself a favor and go follow them. <laughs>